I'm going to start this with a little disclaimer. Dr. Tom Hackett has operated on me three times, uh, two shoulders and one knee, and actually saved my right knee, so uh, I, I am a fan, obviously. Uh, let's, let's talk about how you got to the Stedman Clinic. You had a, a fast-track career going out in California uh, with a very prominent surgeon there and decided to come here. Would you tell us about that? I did, Greg. I, I started out in Los Angeles and um, had a great job there working with all the pro teams. I was really dialed into uh, a very good situation, doing research and, and high-end orthopedic surgery. And I, I got a call from Richard. And Dr. Stebbin gave me a call one day, and uh, it was right when uh, Dr. Hawkins was leaving. And all of a sudden, there was a little bit of an opening here, and I jumped on it. Why jump? Why, why leave a big practice uh, and, uh, and, and Dr. Job, who is famous for Tommy John mm -hmm. surgery, uh, and, and to come to a little town in Colorado? The, this little town in Colorado is a very special place, and what Dr. Stedman built here is a very special um, program and institute and philosophy behind taking care of people and uh, taking care of our profession as well by advancing it through research. And it's just a very unique place to be able to be in a small town in the mountains and be able to do very high quality research at the same time that you're doing high quality surgical experience. Yeah. You were in some surgeries with Dr. Stedman. Of course, I, I presume you would call him a mentor at, at some point. What, what kind of things did you learn from him that made you a better doctor? Yeah, so I was very fortunate. You know, a lot of people know Dr. Stedman. He touched a lot of people, but it, not as many people got to see what he was like in, in the operating room and actually conducting surgery. And the skills that he had working with people and just interacting with people were, were not even a, a tenth of the skills that he has in the operating room as a technician. And so he has a really skilled set of hands and a very uh, tremendous respect for, for tissues and for the body and understanding what you can and can do with, with the knee. Tom Hackett, uh, Dr. Stedman's retired. If you have a problem, call him.